Things like this are very important because it shows young people, especially um, young people of color, that there is somebody like myself who has gone through all these trials and tribulations, but still has a smile on her face and still can make it. I don't give advice that's traditional or conventional. One of the things I kind of kept repeating is it's important to do what it is that makes you happy and you enjoy doing and don't ever let anyone tell you otherwise or convince you that you need to do things solely for monetary gain or because you know society expects you to do certain things or your family. The stories that I heard it made me feel like I wasn't crazy anymore for chasing my own dream. I think I'm gonna walk away with more confidence as well as a different way of understanding and seeing music. What's important about these cat species in the city is that it helps us grow as a community and it helps young artists find their way and find like their kind of path. I love it. Yeah, like uh, me being the only spoken word artist, but like having like Caduce who like does poetry but more singing and then there's like the rappers, the improv, like it's just like a mix of everything. And everyone here is just like amazing. So support is so nice. So far the experience was very good I'd say. And there were there's welcoming people and they always have food which is very good because sometimes I'd be coming from school or after school programs, I'd be really hungry. My mentor Dre and Gozi, uh, she I really connected with her. Janelle McCoy because she said something about she didn't know how to do a specific certain job or had that certain skill set and she still jumped in head first and completely succeeded at it. She was really, really dope because like her story is literally my story, mm -hmm. you know, but like obviously we're not the same art form, but like how she grew up and what she had to go through was literally the exact same thing that I went through. It gives young people an opportunity to engage, to express themselves in a very unique way. Uh, provides them with a safe space um, to do that as well as and to learn and to connect with people who are already doing the kind of work um, out in the city of Toronto uh, as well as internationally. When the audience was asking them certain questions so many of them mentioned my name and I literally was crying. <laughs> I was like I was like wow to think that my story it's so many of them it warmed my heart tremendously. They're all so talented and just beautiful, um, just beautiful people, and I wish them all the entire best. Well, one of the things that I talked about with the youth was the importance of having mentors or someone that you can ask questions to, because I didn't really have that growing up. I love talking to youth. I love sharing my experience and basically giving them hope. It's important because I don't think these types of conversations necessarily happen in school and they're probably not happening at home either. So where, where are youth going to see the various options and various career paths that they can take? Well, a lot of them that I realized was like, they started from like kind of nothing and they built their way up. So a big thing was just like their dedication. Even though they failed, they like came back. One of the exercises actually I had them do was kind of, was to write down what they wanted to do, you know, when they grow up and what are some of the obstacles in the way of that and then come up with a solution for every single obstacle. I can go to people and be like, hey, what's up, how you doing? Like, you know, like we're all connected, like we're all moving, like we're kind of like a family now. So like, I think that's really, really dope and that'll take away something. By supporting this program, it gave me an opportunity to do something that I love and hopefully when I grow up I can develop it, make it bigger, make it better, and work on my craft. Instead of everyone trying to figure things out on their own, I think it's really important to have this sense of community or someone that you can just kind of call up um, and offer any bit of guidance, you know, because why not? I think it's important to share information. I just wanted to show that being different is okay and how you can turn this so-called negative into an amazing positive. I just hope to continue to grow and no matter what discipline I choose in the future that I take what I've learned from dancing and my career so far in this program and apply it to the rest of my life. I just want to be able to be happy with what I do, uh, create the music that I want to create at the, at the end of the day and hopefully try paying some bills. We're putting young people first, uh, we're centering their needs and what they want to kind of say and I'm just happy along with Artscape and the, the Slate Family Foundation to be a part of that journey.